landscape across rural America has undergone a radical change in the last decade or so. Among the wheat and cornfields, we see clusters of tall, graceful windmills rotating in the breeze, promising a clean supply of energy for the future. The wind energy market currently is booming. There's been huge increases over the last 10 years and even more increases scheduled for the next 10. The goal is to have 20% wind energy for the United States. Working in green energy is exciting because you can potentially bring energy to the market that is friendly to the environment, but it's challenging because you have to do that in a cost-effective manner so the market can actually afford the energy. Wind energy is particularly attractive because wind is not only sustainable and carbon free, but the raw material, the breeze, is absolutely free. However, the 21st century wind turbines used to convert wind into electricity are not, and represent a significant equipment investment. Southwest Research Institute is involved in, in wind energy challenges in, in two major ways. One is helping people with ideas, bring those ideas to concept and to prototype reality and performing testing for them or doing design analysis. And another area that we uh, help in the wind energy industry is to do machine reliability studies and improve the reliability of existing designs or new designs for conventional wind turbine technology. One of the main problems that we're seeing in the wind turbine industry is gearbox failure. Every time a gearbox fails, it's very expensive to remove the gearbox, replace the failed components, and reinstall the gearbox. Currently, wind technology is more or less in the Model T stage of development. The technology is proliferating, but there's tremendous potential for improvements. The windmills themselves are new, but the actual nuts and bolts of operations involve a familiar set of mechanical gearboxes and shafts. In the oil and gas industry, Southwest Research Institute has, has performed torsional analysis and vibration troubleshooting for decades, and it turns out wind turbine drive trains have, can have similar problems. And so Southwest Research Institute has had the opportunity in the past few years to apply that skill to wind turbine drivetrains and to solve some critical torsional dynamic problems in those drivetrains. The wind energy gearboxes are being placed in situations that no other gearboxes have ever been designed to be used. Uh, besides just torque, they're also having other five degrees of freedom applied to the gearboxes. Southwest Research Institute has a, a team of field engineers that can travel to any on-site location worldwide to solve vibration problems and reliability problems. Root cause failure analysis of bearings and gearbox components often involves a multidiscipline approach including metallurgical analysis, sometimes finite element analysis, or fluid dynamic analysis. Decades of multidisciplinary expertise applied in related areas can now address the reliability challenges facing the emerging wind energy industry to help create the next generation of wind turbines. Southwest Research Institute is often uh, approached by clients looking for help developing a, a prototype idea. They have an idea how to extract more wind uh, energy from the same amount of wind using less uh, equipment. And so we are able to bring to bear our expertise in mechanical design, mechanical analysis, fluid dynamic analysis, and testing to develop prototypes for these clients and help them to understand how their machine will really behave in a real environment. Current gearbox testing techniques only address the torque of the gearbox. What Southwest is proposing is applying the other five degrees of freedom, FX, FY, FZ, MX, and MY, to the input shaft of the gearbox. This will more accurately simulate life on top of the tower and enable the industry to improve their highly accelerated life testing capabilities. In addition, inspection technology developed for the aerospace industry can be applied to wind turbine operations data to predict impending problems. Southwest Research Institute has developed the Invariable Statistical Process Control Tool, which we call INSPECT, and it's an automated anomaly detection tool that's used to increase production, decrease downtime, and increase safety for mechanical and electrical systems. And what provides the leap in technology for INSPECT is the way that we've automated those capabilities in the wind turbine industry, where a single gearbox loss can represent hundreds of thousands of dollars and an equal amount of money in lost production time. INSPECT can detect those problems before uh, the catastrophic failure occurs, can allow the maintainers to schedule maintenance. Assessing problems with current equipment will shed light on the directions for tomorrow's designs. The wind industry is still an emerging field. 
To take this industry to the next level, improvements must be made to the reliability of these systems.